All right, so what's good, everybody? Um, you know, hope you're having a great day. It's about two weeks into 2019, so hope you're having a blast as well. It's been a good year so far, and you know, just wishing all the best in the future endeavors. Right, today I thought, you know what, let's try something new a food review. Right, I'm a foodie myself, so if there's something that's new up or trending in the market, why not just try it? Right, and today it's going to be something a bit special. Right, so this is the McDonald's, right, the McDonald's bag, and apparently McDonald's in Singapore, they have a new item in promotion, right, they're trying something new, I've never heard of this product before, and it's because, you know, they're jumping on the bandwagon, right, it's trendy, it's an item that's everywhere, in, at least in Singapore, it's somewhat famous from, okay, so the flavour is salted egg yolk, but it's ranging from, like, potato chips to about anything you can get, right, chicken, so on and so forth, and one of the weird, like, so-called, uh, trend that Singaporeans really like it's salted egg yolk fish skins personally I've never tried them I'm not really a big fan of fish skins because it doesn't really taste appetizing but maybe I can try it as well there are a few brands that do it and I think in recent times news has this controversy whereby you know apparently the salted fish skin was contaminated but with a lizard so hey more protein I guess but you know what now let's get back to the main point for today's food review and that would be the salted egg yolk fries from mcdonald's oh, sorry loaded fries from mcdonald's and yeah let's just get that in right all right so this is how the box looks it's not really that big of a box right it doesn't really look big that's what she said and yeah um, the smell is already kind of off-putting it's quite pungent it's quite strong it's not really that appetizing it doesn't it's not really like big bread right it doesn't turn you on but then again, let's not judge things. I hope it's good. I mean, the so far, you know, when you look at the comments in the Facebook or any social media, they've been quite bad, to be honest, right? I mean, some people say it's not really that bad, but most of them are saying it's atrocious. I hope it's not really that bad because, you know, I, I, I like when people try something new and hopefully it's not really that bad to the point that I have to throw it in the trash. But you know, speaking of loaded fries, I think McDonald's around last year, they had something similar, right? It, I think it's called the uh, sour cream something loaded fries. And that was good. I, I'll be honest, I was eating it like almost every other day, like in a month, at least about two weeks, right? So it was really that good. But this is, uh, I don't know, man, the smells of putting. So you know what? Let's, let's just you know, eat it, right? Eat it, yeah. Tuck it in. Right, so this is how the box looks like and these are the fries okay the, the portion of the sauce is quite generous I'd say I mean there's some parts that don't have them but it's okay it's all right so far the smell it's still quite strong I mean it's, it's like durian but worse right? I mean it doesn't smell like durian I mean oh so I'm sorry you know let's not even talk about durian because it's like a holy grail over here like people they adore it to the point whereby it's really crazy. I've never, you know, being in Singapore, I've never tried durian as well, so I've got to try it. But I've tried durian flavored stuff, but this is a different smell to it. It's like sort of an industrial chemical smell, right? It doesn't really smell that appetizing, and now the whole room is just filled with this intense, robust stench. I, I like to say that, but you know what, let's hope that the taste is at least quite decent, I mean, it's fries, you can't really go wrong with it, so let's just try a bit, you know what, let's just try a f bit of the fries, with a bit of the sauce, and yeah. Wow! It's really quite weird. Man. Alright, apart from the smell, the taste is really quite sour, there's this tangy taste to it, right, and it's sort of a bit overwhelming. I wouldn't really say it's that bad, but at the same time, it's not really that good either, right, it's somewhat in the middle, I'm sitting on the fence on this. I don't want to give it so much hate, but at the same time, to be honest, there's nothing really good about it, I mean, just two bites in, I really don't really want it, I think I just eat this. The Right, the fries on the side and the sauce is actually not that bad. I mean, they can try to, you know, make sure the smell is not really that strong or, you know, just tone it down a bit, dilute it or 
do something about it, then the then I think it'd be nice. But on top of that as well, it doesn't really taste like salted egg yolk, right? It's very sour, very tangy. So maybe you know what they can brand it as something else like sour cream, salted egg yolk, tangy sour cream. It's not really salted egg yolk. No, I don't really taste any salted egg yolk bits in there, right? Just Alright, maybe you get a bit like salty, eggy taste, but it doesn't really taste like the salted egg yolk powder and stuff, right? So, I'm sorry, McDonald, right? I think this is kind of a miss the salted egg yolk loaded fries. But for those of you who've never tried it or you know have access to it, right? Whereby you know, let's say I don't know if it's branches out into some other countries and stuff, just give it a go. I mean, like. You know, there's of course a preconceived notion that's not really good, but um, you know, taste is subjective, right? Um, something that I like, you might not like it. Something that I might not like it, you might love it. Right? And that's the beauty of food. Food is food, and food is pay. Food is good. So eat it. Make sure that you have some food. Like, I mean, I kind of felt like it's kind of a waste of money because this is about four dollars, four dollars ten cents Singapore, and I think. It's about three USD or something, right? I'm not so sure what the rates are right now. It's around that price range, or if you're talking about GBP, that's divided by two, so it's about two pounds. For that money, you can get something else from McDonald's that's more filling, and I mean, just add off a few more dollars and you can get a complete meal. But it's, I mean, I don't want to call it a tragedy or a failure, but it's not really. It's like meh, or honestly, it's like nah. You know, it's not really that great as well right so let's make the salted egg yolk loaded fries great again let's you know see if you can change it you know perhaps brand it as something else because some people might like that taste you know it's quite tangy but it's, of course on top of that's just a smell right? it's like still lingering around my mouth and it's kind of like you know diffused throughout the room i think the whole room now kind of smells like it right the fries are a bit soggy uh, but that's because i think it's about 10 minutes since i bought this so, you know, maybe reheat it, then I'll get a bit more, and yeah, that's about it, really. So, tell me, you know, if you there's any McDonald's items or promotions that you've really liked, or, you know, any fast food, right? Um, I'll go and get some hamburgers, or I don't know how Trump says it, but yeah. So, you know, uh, yeah, <laughs> just let me know, like, if there's anything from fast food that you really like that's a promotional item. You know, around this point in time, it's the going to be the Chinese New Year, I think, at 5th or 6th February, and that's about two weeks left. And McDonald's do bring about this Prosperity Burger, uh, chicken and beef, as well as the Twister, Twister or Curly Fries. Those were great, right? I remember, like, you know, I get them every single year, the Chicken Prosperity Burger uh, and the Twister Fries for every meal. I purposely I get the McDonald's just for the Twister Fries, the curly fries because they were that good. But this is I'd say it's a miss, right? But it is good at least McDonald's. You try it if you don't risk it, you don't know, right? But I mean, let's just hope that there's some better promotions out there. Let me know what are your thoughts if you've tried it or if you've never, you know, would you want to try it based on what I've said so far, and just. Let me know, like, if there's any particular fast food item that's, you know, really good regionally or internationally, right, that you'd say it's really worth your money, right, get a banker back and, yeah, till then, you know, I hope you have a nice day, have a nice life, you know, catch you later, see you soon, peace, thanks, bye.